the Frank Cella backlash is real, and Justin Bieber is taking sides. Doja Cat is teasing new music in the most Doja Cat way. I go on a speed date with Koi LeRae. We run down the top songs you're talking about on Twitter. And Lainey Wilson lets us know the five things you should know about her. Hey guys, I'm Tetris Kelly for Billboard News. It's Tuesday, April 18th. I'm back from Coachella, kind of struggling, but I brought some drama with me. You're welcome. It may seem that Coachella attendees were left angry or confused by Frank Ocean, but he has support in Justin Bieber. It was Frank Ocean's first live performance in six years, but was not really what oceanographers expected. And listen, I was there, my dude sounded real good, but I was a bit lost. Justin Bieber has chimed in. He said, I was blown away by Frank Ocean's Coachella performance. His artistry is simply unmatched. His style, his taste, his voice, his attention to detail, I was deeply moved. It made me want to keep going and get better as an artist. He continues to set the bar high and gave me a night I will never forget. Thanks, Frank. It truly was a night we'd never forget, and thank you, Justin Bieber, for giving us perspective on what regardless was a very rare and memorable experience. Now let's talk about Doja Cat. She's doing what Doja Cat does. Everyone's been asking Doja Cat to tease new music, and she's delivered. Well, kinda. Okay, there's one. All right, here's another one. There's one, and then here's another one. Okay. Doja Cat hopped on Instagram Live to give a sneak peek at her new album called Hail Mouth. Allegedly. And I got this one, which I really like. Okay. And then there, here's another one that's definitely going to be on the album. Okay. And here's <laughs> so another one. This is, look, there's like at least 25. And we're just narrowing it down, but these are definites right here. So I'm just going to play you a little piece. <laughs> Doja played snippet after snippet. And we don't know if she's trolling, but at least she's giving us something. She also posted what looks like the track list for the new album. Who knows what's real, but one song we know won't be on the album, Zero. According to producer Monroe, the beat from the new Jeans song was initially made for Doja Cat. Can you imagine Doja spitting on that track? Whatever's next, we'll be waiting. Now let's get to my girl, Koi LeRae. She's killing it on the charts, and if you want to know more about her, well, I took her on a speed date to get to know her better. Uh, yeah, yeah, cause girls is players too. Where are you from? I'm from Jersey. I was born in Boston, uh, specifically Roxbury, Massachusetts, but yeah. What's your sign? I'm a tourist. What was your dream job as a kid? My dream job as a kid was to be a chef. Can you cook, girl? I could cook. I want to see what this tastes like. Oh. We getting doughy, people. We getting doughy. What's your favorite dish, then? What, what, what's going to be on the menu? I love surf and turf. That's my favorite thing to eat. What's your favorite fast food joint? Uh, McDonald's all day. Shout out McDonald's and my McDonald's family. We outside. Celebrity crush. Uh, my celebrity crush. Hi, <laughs> got me blushing. I don't <laughs> oh, know. Now I got to know. I don't know. I don't want to say it. Please, it can be embarrassing. Tell it. Uh, I don't know. I'm so scared. <laughs> I'll be 26, like he, he, you know what I'm saying? Like this oh, crush might be mine one day. Like, you know, I'm manifesting it. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna let you manifest. Let me manifest. <laughs> Your favorite place to vacation. I've never really been anywhere. I feel like this year is my time to travel. I want to go to Turks. Um, I'm Puerto Rican and I'm also from Cape Verde. I'm Cape Verdean, so I also want to go to the Cape. I want to go there and I want to go to like Bahamas. Okay, listen, listen, you're going to be on the plane. You out here. I'm outside. While everyone was watching Coachella on YouTube this weekend, we've been watching what y'all are talking about on Twitter. August D takes control of Billboard's Hot Trending Songs chart as the BTS member sees two entries in the top five. BTS's Sugar lands at the top spot on the Hot Trending Songs chart dated April 22nd with his August D Hagum while Amygdala hits number three. The August D entries in the top three form a Taeyeon sandwich with her single Toddler taking the number two spot. Lauren Spencer Smith re enters the top 10 as Best Friend Breakup comes back in at number 7. 
Billboard's Hot Trending Songs chart powered by Twitter tracks global music-related trends and conversations in real time across Twitter, viewable over the last 24 hours or past seven days. Before we go, let's learn more about Lainey Wilson. Here's five things to know about her. My name is Lainey Wilson and here are five things you do not know about me. Number one, I used to impersonate Hannah Montana. That was my high school job. I did it from eighth grade all the way through 12th grade. Number two, I wrote my very first song at nine years old. Number three, I grew up on the back of a horse. Number four, I'm not the one with the accent. Y'all are. <laughs> and number five, I'm from a town of 200 people in Northeast Louisiana. It's crazy, it's crazy. You know everybody. It's like, that's like, the, it's the best thing and the worst thing all together. That is the show. It feels good to be back and I'm so excited for tomorrow's show. We've got Rita Ora and Lauren Gray in studio. I'm Tetris Kelly and this is Billboard News.